All right, let me see your foot now. So if I try to put your foot, you can see this hump right here in his foot and how his toes go up. Both of your feet are like that. Try and to... Why is, my... why is the hump there? Tilt it. Because you don't, you can't hold your feet up. Try to pull your foot up flat. See, he cannot pull his feet up flat. Hi! Can you think of a funner subject to talk about than feet? No! Yeah. No. It doesn't... Sound... Welcome, you guys. Welcome to our channel. Welcome back to our channel. If, if you have children with autism and they're tippy-toe walkers, that is an important clip to see. You see the foot. You see oh, the foot. Right? Try to make your foot go flat. This. And, uh, yeah, not good. So, welcome, you welcome. guys. Welcome to our channel. Welcome back to our channel if you're coming back. If you are, thank you so much for supporting our channel. And hello to everybody. If you're new, subscribe. Subscribe. You know, um, yeah, I'm going to skip all that. Just follow the little button right there and subscribe. And it would be really appreciated because we're trying, I'm trying so hard to build this channel. Um, but anyways, let's get into the topic, which is feet. I know these are hands, but it's my, it's feet. These, so uh, let's talk about feet. Joshua's feet, to be exact. Do you know how long you've walked on your toes for? Um, almost my entire life. You have. You have. Can you do one thing for me? What? There's your feet flat. Look at that. You got flat feet. Can you stand on your flat feet? I'll, I'll hold her. Without holding on to anything, can I see you stand on your flat feet? Without holding on to anything, can you do it? No, I can't. Try to go down to your flat. Yeah, it's hard. Go down on your flat now while you hold something. Can you do it? No. That's cheating. <laughs> you can't stand up, can you? Does it hurt or are you just unbalanced? You can't balance and it kind of hurts. And it does hurt. Where's it hurt at? Can you point to where it hurts? Right here. In the Achilles back here. So, let me see your toes. Pick up your foot, honey. You come here, honey. So this is the problem. It hurts back here and his toes, his little toes. So we have, um, I have a couple of different oils. I have a lavender oil that I can put on his feet. And then he also had braces that, you remember your braces for your feet? They, they would pull his feet. They were, they would make his feet go from this and then after a while, they slowly would pull his feet up. And then with physical therapy, making him walk on his flat feet is the only way to get your feet to go flat or surgery. What do you think about if you were to have surgery? What would you think about that? If you had to have surgery on your feet. Do you know what surgery means? What? Do you know what that is? I know. What is it? It's like when they fix something. Right. In the hospital, right? Yeah. They go in and fix it. And I know that there's a, a, a very rare surgery they do that can correct that. But we're getting him back into physical therapy. And we're going to show you guys. We're going to show everybody how physical therapy helps you with your feet. But right now, he can't walk on his flat feet at all, can you? Can you walk on your flat feet at all? You try to, right? You try to. But is it hard? It's hard for you to balance. Yeah. Can you run? Yeah, only on my toes. You run on your toes, don't you? Yeah. yeah. So we're going to start correcting that again with physical therapy, and we're going to show everybody how we get your feet healed and hopefully get your feet flat. Okay. If you have a toe walker, best advice I can give you is, although when they're little, it is cute to watch them on their toes, get them on their flat feet. Especially if you are suspected, uh, it, you're suspecting an autism uh, child, because they get into the habit of walking on their toes. 
and it is extremely hard to get them out of that. Did you say if so? My butterscotch is ready. Oh, your butterscotch, right? Okay. <laughs> surgery and I do not want this child to have a surgery the way he walks always on his toes when he's standing yeah, he's on his that's toes. that is 24 7 he's had days where he couldn't walk and he's literally had to crawl because his feet were so sore so there are boots that they can put braces that they can put on him at night that he does have but he will not wear them the basic idea of it is they have two straps on either side it's like a boot, their foot slides into it, and it's adjustable. There's two straps on either side, and you just crank the straps, and you slowly start to bring their foot up. Every night, you bring it up a little bit more and a little bit more until they're flat. So that is through a physical therapy prescription that you get those. And um, I, if, if we had any success with them, I would tell you about it. The only reason why we didn't have success is because he would not wear them. They were very uncomfortable. It looks like little cast boots. Um, so if you do have tippy toe walkers, oh my goodness, I cannot stress enough. Get them on their flat feet. And it is a constant reminder. With Joshua, it is constant. Walk on your flat feet. Walk on your flat feet. There's been a lot going on, and uh, we're going to be doing a, covering a lot of topics with Joshua. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for subscribing. And we're trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. Also, there is a Twitter project going around right now for autism families. For anybody who has autism, I'm going to drop that below in the description box. You guys check it out. We're going to do it, but I don't know everything about it. Um, it's Pastiche is the person that is doing this, and I think they're doing written uh, information on your family member, loved one, or yourself if you have autism, or you can do a video, and they will give you all the information. If you want to check that out, I know that they're, they're getting ready to finish the project. You only have a few days left. So hurry and go check that out. Check that out. I, I hope you guys uh, like the video. And have a great weekend. See you guys. Peace.